Hello students, welcome to our channel Learning Notebook. In today's video, we will do part 1 of chapter Measurement. In this part 1, we will learn about measuring length and conversion of length units. Students, when we talk about measurement, we do measurement of length, measurement of weight or mass and measurement of capacity. In this part 1, we will cover measurement of length. To measure length, we use standard units like centimeter, meter and kilometer. First, let's discuss centimeter. In short, centimeter is written as cm. Students, we use centimeter to measure short length. For example, length of safety pin, length of pencil, or length of pen. They are measured in centimeter. We also use cm to measure short height. For example, height of table, height of chair are measured in centimeters. Next standard unit to measure length is meter. In short, meter is written as small m. We use meter to measure long length like Length of room, length of car or length of truck. Meter is also used to measure short distance. For example, distance from your bedroom to kitchen is measured in meter. Students, we also use meter to measure long height. For example, height of tree or height of buildings, they are measured in meter. Students, Next standard unit to measure length is kilometer. In short, kilometer is written as km. Kilometer is used to measure long distance. For example, distance between two cities is always measured in kilometer. So students, to summarize, centimeter is used to measure short length and short height. Meter is used to measure long length, short distance and long height. And kilometer is used to measure only long distance. Now let's see conversion of length units. Till now we have learned three standard units of length which are centimeter, meter and kilometer. Now students let's see how to convert kilometer into meter and meter into centimeter. 1 kilometer equals to 1000 meter. So to convert kilometer into meter, we will multiply by 1000. For example, 2 kilometer equals to 2 into 1000 which is equal to 2000 meter. Next, 1 meter equals to 100 centimeter. So to convert meter into centimeter, we will multiply by 100. For example, 2 meter equals to 2 into 100 which is equal to 200 centimeter. Now let's do an exercise to understand conversion of length units. First question is 12 meter equals to how many centimeter? Students, I just told you 1 meter equals to 100 centimeter. So to convert 12 meter into centimeter, we will multiply it by 100 and we get 12 into 100 equals to 1200 centimeter. Now second part is 9 meter 3 centimeter equals to how many centimeter? 9 meter equals to 9 into 100 which is equal to 900 centimeter. 900 centimeter plus 3 centimeter equals to 903 centimeter. Third part is 10 meters equals to how many centimeters? Students, 1 meter equals to 100 centimeter. Therefore, 10 meter equals to 10 into 100 equals to 1000 centimeter. Now, next one is 6 kilometer equals to how many meter? We know 1 km equals to 1000 meter. So to convert 6 km into meter, we will multiply it by 1000. Therefore, 
six kilometer equals to six in two thousand equals to six thousand meter. Now last one is seven kilometer eight hundred meter equals to how many meter? Students, one kilometer equals to thousand meter. Therefore, seven kilometer equals to seven in two thousand equals to seven thousand meter. And seven thousand meter plus eight hundred meter equals to seven thousand eight hundred meter. Now let's solve a word problem based on measurement of length units. Neha walked five kilometer five hundred meter, and John walked four kilometer seven hundred meter. How much did they walk in all? How much more did Neha walk than John? Students. Always solve word problem with the help of statements. So Neha walked equals to five kilometer five hundred meter. John walked equals to four kilometer seven hundred meter. Therefore, together they walked equals to five kilometer five hundred meter plus four kilometer seven hundred meter. Write them in columns as shown here. Write meter values below meter unit and write kilometer values below kilometer unit. Now let's add them. Zero plus zero equals to zero. Again, zero plus zero equals to zero. Five plus seven equals to twelve. Regroup twelve. Two comes in the answer and one gets carried over. Now one carry plus five plus four equals to ten. Therefore, together they walk ten kilometer two hundred meter. Now we have to find how much more did Neha walk than John. So, students, we will find the difference, or we will subtract four kilometer seven hundred meter from five kilometer five hundred meter. Write them in columns as we did while adding. Now let's subtract. Zero minus zero equals to zero. Again, zero minus zero equals to zero. Now five is weaker than seven, so it takes help from its neighbor five. Neighbor five is kind-hearted and gives one of its power. So neighbor five becomes four, and five becomes fifteen. Now fifteen minus seven equals to eight, and four minus four equals to zero. Therefore, Neha walked eight hundred meter. More than John, so our answer statement would be: They walked ten kilometer two hundred meter in all, and they have walked eight hundred meter more than John. So, students, in this video, we learned about standard units of measuring length: meter, centimeter, and kilometers, and how to convert kilometer into meter and meter into centimeter. We also solved a word problem based on length units. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then do hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook and make sure to press the bell icon. Thank you. Bye bye. See you in the next video.